Hello, everybody, and welcome back to WAC Game Club. My name is Will Goodnight. I know it's not July anymore, but I never got to actually legitimately show you guys everything in Spyro 2 Ripto's Rage. There were there was a uh, there was one session that I did that uh, was just completely lost to time, and that's because OBS decided to be a dumb. Oh, CVS is texting me. Apparently, my prescription's ready to be filled. Yay. So, I gotta do this guy. I gotta do the boss fight and uh, some other things in the second realm. So, there, there's quite a lot to do, but I'm looking forward to it. I think I did this in the wrong order. So, no, no, no. I did it in the right order. We're still good. I haven't played Spyro in quite a while. Quite literally since I actually beat the game last I have not touched it um, That and I you know that just goes for recording in general. I have not recorded uh, Anything in quite some time I recorded some Isaac uh, But like I was getting so frustrated with not being able to uh, Get good recordings that I was just like ah I was so frustrated that I wasn't able to, like, um, do uh, r decent enough recordings. I've been doing the Brains Challenge for so long that I was like, all right, screw this. I'm going to do something else. I'm going to try and, uh, you know, just relax and not worry about the Brains Challenge right now. And, uh, and you know, I, I went to go and try and record, like, a, just a regular old Greed Mode run. Maybe that was my problem. I hadn't played Greed Mode in so long either. That I was, that it was just awful. I actually, that was the first video I've ever thrown away just because of my play being bad. So, I don't know. I, I gotta get used to playing games again. I've kind of been in a rut recently, uh, emotionally. And I don't want to be like, you know, I don't want to, uh, start, uh, just complaining to you guys. Because that's, that's not really what I like to do. I don't like to complain in my videos. I like to... Uh, create the illusion that I enjoy life. Oh no. Huh. Hey, hey, hey. I need you to pass away, please. Oh no. Okay. I thought I bunged that up. We're good. Just gotta get into a boom. Hip bloom. Hip bloom. Hip bloom. Hip bloom. No! Oh, my life is nothing but complete torment. Okay. You know, so I, you know, that's why videos have been short uh, recently, at least on my end. They're still going up. Gene's still uploading Rocket League and stuff like that. Um, I would say other people are uploading, but they're not. Uh, I think Shade finally put up Happy Wheels, I think, by the time I was recording this. By the time I am recording this, but I can't be sure 100% actually. Um, I know I've also mentioned it in the other Spyro videos. I hate this controller I'm using. The controls feel super awkward, and I'm not quite sure why. I assume it's just because it is awkward. Hip, hip, sorry if I'm quiet. I, got, I really hate these levels, man. Alright, I did it. Maybe I should just, like, fly over these guys. Yeah, I think that's probably better than rushing them down. At least for now, because, like, with the controls being so slippery, it gets to be real annoying. Hibbly. One more. Hibbly. I did it! Yay! 10 out of 10. Now there's... Now I still gotta get the orb. What orb, you might be telling yourself? Well, if you watch the rest of the series, young Padawan, you know that there are multiple things we gotta do. And I remember where this one is, actually. And then we have to, like, race Hunter, I think. Let me to take a drink of my Diet Pepsi. Apparently, Queen Finney has not watched my series at all. Obviously, I am the greatest... I'm the greatest in the world. Shining, shimmering splendor. I know I have to actually follow him. If I miss one. No. Oh, yeah. It's missing one. That's awful. 
It's not as easy as you thought, now is it? Well, actually, Miss Queen Finny, Queen Finny Fatty, all right, it is. You go, you just go and take your judgment somewhere else with you and your fishness. I don't, I don't dig the fact that you're talking fish. It's kind of strange. Come to think of it, I missed it again. I missed it again. Apparently, anytime I fail, I'm just going to sing that song from Aladdin, which, which, uh, the name I can't particularly remember right now. There's a gnat flying around me, and I hate it. I went out and bought those, those, uh, sticky fly traps, because we've had a bit of a gnat problem since getting the new kitten. I think the smell from the cat boxes are getting to them, which, it is gross, but we, but when you're a cat owner... You kind of understand what I'm talking about. Well, maybe you shouldn't get a cat. Maybe you should get a dog. Well, hey, I like dogs just as much as the next guy. I, in fact, I really do. I love dogs a lot. But I'm, I'm much more of a cat person, IMO. No, 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 no. I did it. Yeah, I'm actually, uh, I'm actually much more of a cat person in my own opinion. Where'd he go? I, I lost him. I hate this. I hate I hate everything about it. Like, uh, I've owned I've owned many dogs, I've owned many cats. I just you know, I've just been more of a cat person. I find I find my at least my cats. I know I know everyone's different. But at least my cats, I like I, I feel like they give a crap. I've met just as many like misbehaved dogs as I have uh, misbehaved cats. And I'm not saying cats can't misbehave. My my cats are can be jerks from time to time. One's relatively old, one's relatively young. That doesn't really spell good things typically, if I'm being completely honest. Oh, I can break those without it being too big of an issue. All right, that's fine with me. Where are we going? Ah, you flew up. Like the Disney film. Great movie, by the way. If you've never seen it, I highly recommend it. We watched it the other day at my work in French. Or was it Spanish? We watched Inside Out in, Span in, in French. That's it. Also something that I would recommend doing. Like, once we, once we see, like... What do you got for me? Great job, Spyro. That was some excellent flying. I know I gave her like three or four different accents in that. I apologize. All right, so like I said, what I'm doing right now is I'm just going through all the levels I hadn't beaten. Um, so there's going to be like the boss battle here, and then I have to go back and finish off some of the levels. I am not looking forward to the turtle stage at all. Yeah, that the turtle stage you've already seen, the sunny beaches or whatever it's called. But there's a mini game on it that's just next to impossible, and I hate it. Aquaria Towers ain't bad, though. We'll probably knock this out and call it an episode. You, sir, are a jerk. He's just a seahorse. He wants some water. Give him some water. He's literally dying. He cannot breathe. He cannot breathe, and he's, like, just drying out dead. All right. What do you got? The funny looking guys with the shock sticks have drained all our water. Man, I apologize. Sorry if I kind of. I, I, I don't want to uh, skip through the dialogue, but like, I've already. I've already beaten the game. <laughs> like, I, I've beat. I have officially beaten this game. I'm just doing this for your guys' sake because I, like, I kind of enjoy having the idea. Or, like, I kind of enjoy the thought of having. A 100% completed thing that people can actually watch. And I'm actually going to make it so these, uh, at least in the playlist I'm going to make, appear in order. Or at least I'm going to try to. So that way, like, if people are watching, they can go ahead and do, like, a full 100% playthrough and stuff like that. It's like they can watch the full series without uh, having any issues. I gotta, I think I should actually start doing everything on the ground before I flood the place. 
Hibla, blah, blah, blah. Hibla, blah, blah, blah. Hibla, hibla. Don't you ever, ever scuttle up to me with your arachnid like features. It's like, hey, Will, uh, crabs aren't arachnids. I don't care what they are. They have more than four legs and they kind of walk in a spidery fashion, in which case, I don't enjoy that. Seriously, I have I have a pretty bad fear of spiders, and it's it's sort of crippling, I gotta be honest. We got anything over here? I don't think so. So yeah, I mean, I've gotten, and I've gotten uh, one of my friends, yeah, like over this whole, over this whole series, I've gotten one of my friends to comment. No, I've, uh, one of my old friends from high school who, ori who I originally, uh, not, I did not do this for, per se, but she was asking when I was going to do more Spyro, and I was like, well, I'm hoping to do it now, uh, this summer, and I know it's not July anymore, but I want to finish this out, uh, as I've already stated, um, she's like, yeah, I went out and bought all three original Spyro games, and I'm going to, uh, beat them like you did. I'm like, oh, that's awesome that I can inspire well, gamers from my hometown. <laughs> I don't, yeah, sure. Metal sharks, I don't care. It's like, pay a, thou pay a thousand gems and you can use my fancy submarine whenever you want. Well, guess what, money bags? I'm not gonna have to use it for too long because I'm gonna get the special flamey power. And now, I know I said in one of my things, in one of the past episodes, I should have the the super flamey power all the time, but I didn't do something right, so it's... Un I forgot I was supposed to just wait on that, but whatever. It's like, hey, you know, you can do the super flame power all the time because you unlock that door in Sandy Shores, and once you start a new game, you can do the super power again. Well, I, I didn't do it. I didn't do something right. I tried to do... I tried to go back and fix it, but it just wasn't working, so I'm like, eh, screw it. I don't, I don't particularly care. <sighs> there's a door. Okay, so I got, there's also this upstage area, and I also gotta take the super fire power and do a lot of things. Maybe I should also, like, kill some of the sheepy, sheepy, sheepy. No, I don't, I don't wanna talk to you. I really don't, Hoppo. Thank you. In fact, I'm gonna put my dragon balls up in your face. Is that a problem? <laughs> well, I mean, it looks like a problem to me. I, I, I wouldn't do that. It's not, uh, it's not something I would recommend putting your dragon balls in someone's face. Unless if they're a Dragon Ball fan. And in which case, I'm talking about the series and not the actual, uh, dragon testicles, which, uh, Spyro may or may not possess gonna keep shooting a whole bunch of crap here yeah we'll go back for another thing because I can't do it all in one go I don't think I can't do it in all one van go <laughs> uh, I don't even know what that joke was if you laughed at that um, I'm going to assume you're just pitying me and in which case I'm eternally grateful fun uh, fun story I was actually um, the Epic Rap Battles of History page, they were like, they posted a picture the other day, and at this point, it's probably like, actually like a week or so ago, of the who, like, they posted a picture saying who's next or whatever, so that, you know, they get fan suggestions on who should be in the next Rap Battles. And I, I actually posted one that got the top comment. It had like well over a thousand likes. And I was pretty proud of myself. It was a, uh, I suggested to do a tag team rematch of uh, Beethoven and Mozart versus Justin Bieber and uh, Skrillex. Uh, that was close. I thought I was going to die there. <laughs> so I suggested that and it got, like I said, it got well over like a thousand likes. And you know what? I felt good. I was like, yay, somebody appreciates my ideas. It's not every day that that happens. Now, here's a question. If this upper world is filled with water, just thought of this, why wasn't it draining down into that thing? You got some explaining to do, game. If that, if that upper world was, fill, was like full of water, why weren't you draining down into the under levels? Enabling me to actually swim everywhere instead of hitting all those switches. 
Or maybe there was like a big cap on it that kind of blew up or whatever once you actually did everything. I don't know. It's a game for the PlayStation. What am I planning to play after this? I don't know. I was thinking about possibly, um... I've been wanting to play Until Dawn. I, I pre-ordered that game, and I've had it since it came out, and I have not touched it at all. Now, granted, I also haven't uh, seen anything of it, so I am completely spoiler-free. I have no idea what happens in the story. I haven't watched the game theories of it. I haven't done anything to actually know what happens in the story. And that's something I deliberately did, so that way when I actually went back to play it, it was all good. I'm excited to actually play that whenever I get the chance. I don't know how many more... How many more gems am I missing? Five? Well, there's one. So I'm missing, like, two green ones now or something. For some reason, I think that's going to be the most likely option, but I could be wrong. I hope it's not in the main level. I really don't want to go look for them. There should... There should... Oh, wait. Where's my map? I gotta get my... Um, the map... Uh... The map is on. Uh, no, it's not. The map is not on. Game. Thank you very much. Well, it's up here. I should be able to see it, right? I should be able to. That's, that's the theory, at least. A game theory. Thanks. For, I'm. I'm just kidding. I'm not. I'm not Matt Pat. Would I trade places with Matt Pat if I could? Yeah, probably. I mean, he's in charge of a. Hey, I'm stuck. Hey, Alameo, where, oh, where are my two gems, dog? They're probably. Now that I think about it, they're probably in the main section, which means I'm gonna just gonna find them on my way back of doing one of these things. I do have to do two uh, mini games here, where I'm on this manta ray. Oh, all right, all right. Right here, we've got the kit. We've got the stingray. The great magical stingray that killed Steve Irwin. No, no, no. No, no, no. Don't. Don't. Just don't. Relax. Like I said, the, the controls are a bit slippery. Well, Let me to take a drink here. I suppose I owe you something for that. Here, take this orb. I found it in one of my flippers. Oh, you mean one of those orbs that I need to actually go home? You just found it in your slipper. That's fine. Thanks, Hunter. See, I remembered your name, too. I didn't call you Chester. That cheap joke about you being the cheetah from uh, the Cheetos. Here's a question. Has anyone had the uh, Mac and Cheetos from... Uh... How did I miss that? Has anyone had the Mac and Cheetos from Burger King? I have not. I'm interested in it. They're also coming out with something called the Whopperito, which is quite literally a Whopper inside of a burrito. And it, it kind of... Really? It's not even a wild ride. Like, I go through the... I go through it. All right, hold on. Let me focus on this for a second. Be a little quiet here. Relax. I thought I was about to miss that again. Anyway, the Whopperito. It's literally a burrito made with the ingredients of a Whopper. Now, I prefer my Whoppers and, and burgers in general with just meat and cheese. So I'm not a, I don't think I'm gonna be too excited for this so-called Whopperito from Burger King. The water working. I'm more, I'm more excited to watch Brad Jones try it. If you could yeah, I gotta, gotta go save your children. I couldn't care less. You're a horrible father. I managed to do that without getting hit, actually, and I'm relatively impressed by myself. What was I saying? The Whopperito, Brad Jones, right? Uh, Brad Jones, the cinema snob. He's one of my he's he's one of my favorite uh, YouTubers. And he does a series called Brad Tries, and inspired me to do a series similar to that on one of my channels. And uh, I don't know, maybe I'll start doing some more of those. It's been a while. I recorded a couple of them with uh, Shade Frost and Gene, but I just haven't found the time to put them up yet. We tried Crystal Pepsi when it I, I won a um. 
I want a bottle of it. Like, uh, originally, it's it should be, like, out now. But, like, uh, earlier this year, they did, like, a giveaway for it. And, uh, you know, I went up and I was like, yo, I went on to eBay. It's like, hey, looky here. I really want to try this. So I bought a, I bought a bottle. I bought a bottle of Crystal Pepsi. Anyway, I bought a bottle of it on eBay, and I came in, and I thought it was really good. It was, uh, it was very similar to Pepsi, but it wasn't as sweet tasting, which, uh, I think is fine, because I'm honestly, I honestly think Pepsi tastes really, really sweet. I'm not a fan of it, really. Um, I li I'd much prefer, it's the same way with Coke. I prefer Diet Pepsi and Diet Coke over regular Pepsi and regular Coke. Uh, I know that's like a sin against like mankind uh, or at least that's what people would have me believe considering uh, all of the things that I could enjoy and then people you know berate me for uh, you don't like you don't like regular coke and Pepsi how dare you um, excuse me sir but I'm just much more of a pe of a dr. pepper fan I love dr. pepper man like there's I love dr. pepper man uh, Marvel comic superhero. All right, got one more, and I really need to find these last two. Um, these last four gems, excuse me. I'm not sure where they are. That's that's the problem, which is gonna be fun trying to find. Maybe they were like, ah, oh, they're right there. Cool. Yay, I did it. Now just gotta find this last thing here. I don't want to ride in your thing because I'm already good. I destroyed all the hazards and I'm back in the hood. <laughs> Let's not start going to the hip hop thing. I, I made that mistake already. Is there like any sheepish, sheepish, sheepies? No, but I could probably tank a hit. Um, yeah, come to think of it, I shouldn't have tanked the hit. Shouldn't have done it. Oh, don't tell me I have to do all of them again. Oh, I hate my life. Okay. That's what you get. That's what I get for being uh, impatient, man. I haven't actually done this uh, mini game properly in quite some time. I always just, like, tank a hit. That's fine. But hey, we finished the level at least, so... As soon as I get this done, we can call it an episode, and I'll go on to the next stage. Uh, I believe it will be Crush. I believe. I believe! That, uh... Guns don't kill people. Husbands that come home early do. That's, uh, Larry the Cable guy, I think. Hey, I like... I like the blue-collar comedy guys, alright? They're not... They aren't my favorite comedians. They used to be. Like, when I was younger, I really, really enjoyed a lot of their comedy. But, you know, that's not even that's not even their problem. Moreover, that uh, when you're younger, you can't, you can't really, like, enjoy. You can't, like, enjoy, like, either super intellectual or dark comedy. Right now, my favorite comedians are super, super dark. Like, I like Daniel Tosh, I like Louis C.K., I like Pat Oswalt. I like all these comedians that just do really dark and interesting bits. You did it! Now yeah, now we can swim in peace. Your crown is also part of your back. It's like you're, you're a Super Saiyan starfish, and I don't really appreciate it. Again, I'm not sure what voice I gave him. I'm sure it's offensive somewhere. Just, uh... Send all of your complaints to um, WASDGameCom at gmail.com. Uh, I completely missed the hole, just like my sex life. I'm, I'm kidding. I'm, I'm still a virgin. Ah, sadly. I haven't dated anyone in years. Sue me. I don't care. Oh, I missed the ending. I apologize. Cool, guys. I'm excited to be playing some Spyro 2 again. I'm going to try and finish it out here tonight, hopefully, so I don't have to do it ever again until next summer. Yay, we can do the thing. I don't care. Yay, well done. Cool, cool, cool. We can go to the Crush Dungeon. 
Thank you guys for watching WAC GameCom. My name is Will. Good night. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. Help us out a great deal. And I will see you guys next time. Now let's open up this final door. This better blow my mind. I've been trying to open this door since I was a little kid. This better be better than like having a literal Hitler to skin. Open up. What? It's just a fire. It's a fire power. Up. What do you expect me to do with this? Do I kill everything? Well, obviously not.